Let's go ahead and look at how we make a level transition. We're going to start with three new objects and set their Z orders compared to Mario. And then a fourth new object, which is going to be extremely large, and we'll call that one Fade. Now for the code, whenever Mario hits that finish bar, we're going to want to delete the finish bar. And then we'll start a new timer. When that timer is under three seconds, we're going to stop controls to Mario and force him to move forward, fade in that black, and set it on top of Mario. And once that timer is over three seconds, we can change our scene. And there we have it. Come and check out the full tutorials on my YouTube channel.